today is Tuesday it feels like Monday though we are back after a long weekend I'm going to work I don't feel like going to work but I I have to go to work okay six and a half hours later I'm a free man going home now and then I have to go to another meeting I'm meeting I'm going to open an account in a new bank and everything is done online but I have to go and meet the representative at the bank because uh, it's a little bit different for international students um, for those who do not have a residentship here so I'll keep you updated on that So I'm back from Tangerine. I was there to open a new account. The reason why I was opening a new account was, um, let me explain to you the banking system in Canada first. So there are these top five banks, like the major five banks as we call them in Canada, that, that, that have like a major chunk of Canadian banking system. And the thing with those banks are they are good, they're actually perfect. But the only thing with them is like um, they have different rules for resident and non-resident and me like as an international students we as an international students fall under non-residents and they have different rules for resident and non-resident so one of them being like if you want to apply for a visa or a credit card um, they cannot give you an unsecured credit card what that means is um, say for example if you want uh, like a two thousand dollar visa or a $2,000 MasterCard, then you have to put $2,000 aside, like locked. You cannot touch that amount as like a security for them to give you a credit card, which, uh, which, which actually defeats the purpose of a credit card. You need a credit card to like use the money and pay it later. And so with these banks, some do, some don't, um, but the thing with Tangerine is like it's an online bank. It's a new player in the Canadian banking industry and um, they have rules which are a little bit relaxed. There's another online bank called um, BC Financial Bank and Canadian Dar Bank. These three or four banks like have a little bit relaxed rules. And what happens with that is like I went, I walked in and I showed all my documents as a proof of address and I applied for a MasterCard. So with these banks, I can apply for a MasterCard or a credit card or Visa without giving like a security deposit. And that's the only reason why I, I was opening an account at Tangerine. And the other thing you should know about uh, these online banks is they don't have branches. Uh, they have like three or four branches in the whole Toronto area, the GTA as we call Greater Toronto Area. They partner with these five banks to use their ATM machines, which is fine. But the only thing you have to keep in mind is like they don't have physical locations. Everything is online. I, I opened my account online. I just had to go to their actual main office to show my statement showing my residential address. And so that that sums it up. <clears throat> and now I'm back to studying for a bit. I have my assignment due tomorrow. So I have to complete that. So today is Wednesday and I have a very, very, very short day. Um, I just finished school and I have like three hours of work and that is because I am limited by the number of hours that I can work on the study permit but uh, yeah half the day is done I am heading to work now it should be done soon hello everyone I am done with my day today and today was a busy busy day at work yeah I am super tired I am just gonna go home eat whatever is there like ready packet food and just gonna go home and sleep see you guys tomorrow welcome everyone good morning it is a wonderful Thursday today uh, yesterday I fell asleep early but today I am pumped today is gonna be a nice day 
I first stop at school. Um, today is like the first day after a long, long weekend. Like we had a week off for vacation. Like after every semester, you have a week off. So today is the day when I go back to school, meet my friends. Super excited, and then I have work as usual. So see you guys at the school. So I am done with school now. Finished all the submissions for the assignment. Quite proud of myself. I have to reach at work in like 15 minutes. See you later. So I am done working now. Headed back home, waiting for my friend. It's a nice car. Look at this girl. Look at this girl. See her walking around. You know what to do. You just tie a cloth around her face and just kidnap her. <laughs> Look closely. <laughs> Welcome back, guys. Today is the most favorite day of the week. Today is Friday, and I'm pumped. One reason being, uh, I'm changing my place of work. Uh, I'm still with the same company, but I'm just changing the branch or the office where I work at to a new place. So today is like my last day at my this office. Uh, let's see how it goes. But before that need to go to the school okay so I'm back from work now it was a different day today I was pumped up before I went to work but uh, I kind of feel a little bit low after finishing work today it was my last day at this branch so yeah I don't know I just go home eat sleep we'll see so a slight change in plan I was about to sleep but my idiot friends booked a movie ticket uh, we are going to watch Spider-Man 3, 2, what it is, whatever Spider-Man 2 uh, Homecoming nice. Oh, Spider-Man Homecoming Spider-Man Homecoming So it's gonna be another 3 hours and then I'll go to sleep finally Yeah, see you guys after the movie The movie was wonderful A solid 8 on 10 Watch it guys, it's it's super fun It's super comedy and like it's a real Marvel movie 